Hello friends, welcome to Creative Zone. In this part, I'm going to tell you about diode. I mean, structure of diode and how it works. But you have to watch earlier part to understand this topic properly. Link in description. Whatever. Let's begin today's one. Diode. It's a simple and fundamental element in electronics. Almost every electronics device made by diode and transistor. Whatever. Time to know how diode is made. Okay. Generally silicon is used to make diode. We already know pure silicon can transport electricity properly. So need doping. Question is what type of impurities? N type or P type? Okay, actually diode made by both type of impurities. One side doped with P type and other side doped with N type impurities. See, inside of the diode we will have free electrons and P side we will have holes. Now focus on PN junction of this diode. Free electrons on N side have a natural tendency to fill the holes which are available on P side. Uh, as a result, P side border is slightly negatively charged and N side border is slightly positively charged. Now you can see the depletion layer is created. This layer builds a potential barrier for electron flow. Now, if you connect a battery as external power source with the diode like this, then positive terminal of this battery attract the electrons from N side and negative terminal of this battery attract holes from P side. As a result, width of the depletion layer increase. In this case, electricity flow is impossible. This condition known as reverse bias of diode. However, if you connect negative terminal of this battery with N side and positive terminal with P side of the diode, then electrons cross the potential barrier to fill this hole and again jump nearby hole. Again and again. It's a continuous process, I mean. Whatever. Look at the depletion there. It's too narrow. This condition known as forward bias of diode. So we can say diode works like one way valve for the electron flow. That's why diode known as semiconductor rectifier. Now VI characteristics. Actually diode has non-linear characteristics. Look at the graph. VF mean forward voltage, VR mean reverse voltage and as usual I for current. In forward bias you can negligible current flow until cross potential barrier. After cross that current rapidly increase. In reverse bias we got few current but you can neglect this. Applying high voltage in reverse, it will damage a diode but we will get high current flow. The value of high voltage is known as reverse breakdown voltage. Anyway, that's all of this topic. See you on next part. Stay with Creative Zone. Have a nice day.